Worldwide, there are more than 600 species of carnivorous plants. Unique amongst these, the Bornean fanged pitcher plant not only traps insects, but also provides a home for the carpenter ant Campanotus schmitzi. The plant's insect traps are unusually long-lived, but like most pitcher plants, insects are lured with nectar. When they arrive, slippery trapping surfaces cause them to slide into the pitchers, where they are digested by the fluid inside. Amazingly, the resident ants are immune to the traps, nesting inside hollow stems of the plant, feeding on the trap's nectar without falling, and even stealing prey from the pitchers by swimming and diving in the digestive fluid. Here, an ant removes a fruit fly that has fallen into the pitcher. Many ant plants have evolved close relationships with ants, as the ants provide protection from leaf-feeding insects and fungal attack in return for nesting space and food. The fanged pitcher plant, however, is the only known insect-eating ant plant, but it is still unclear what, if anything, the plant gains from the association. We discovered that Campanotus schmitzi ants thoroughly clean the slippery trapping surface of their host plant, Videos set up to monitor the ant's daily activity showed us the ants walking slowly over the slippery trapping surface and cleaning it with their mouths. Taking photos using an electron microscope showed us that the trapping surfaces of pitchers from plants that were colonised by the ants were much cleaner than those that were not. Furthermore, over time, this meant that uncolonized pitchers became much less slippery compared to ant colonized pitchers. We made this link between cleaning and capture success by recording the proportion of ants that fell into colonized and uncolonized pitchers that had only recently opened and were therefore clean. We then contaminated the pitchers with starch and repeated the test. Notice how many fewer ants fall into the pitcher. We then returned after a week to repeat the test once more. We confirmed that even when strongly contaminated by starch, the ants cleaning restored the slipperiness of the trap within only a few days. So by cleaning the trapping surface, the ants maintain it in good condition, allowing it to continue to catch insects for much longer than if the ants are absent.